sawa cheni tupike kachai tupike kachai wenye miudu utachukua hii small cup juice staki chai sana size so alafu pia nime nimelenga sukari kunywi sukari mob sana kaka sukari kiasi tu kiasi kama krima zimearibika kuna kama shinika kutuwekea maziwa hapa lakini kameharibika so tuta tutatumia tu hii maziwa ya hizi packet hizi hey so what's up guys uh mr sam here uh so I'm taking a trip to Nashville for some job and uh, let me just bring you with me and let's see how the road looks like from here to Nashville, Tennessee coming from Raleigh, North Carolina. No, actually I moved. I'm in Wake Forest, North Carolina. Wake Forest, yeah! Uh, so let's go to Nashville. I'll see you at Wangu. Naona venye mafuta imepanda bay. Imepanda bay kupanda lakini na ayo bay kipanda na sisi tunangangana na mfuko. Tunapandisha mfuko juu. E, hapa tuko ndiyo tukumekaribia Tennessee. Tuko mali tuko ama mahai weuku. But tunaendelea na jani. Tuko highway inaitua 40 East. 40 East, hii highway imetoka North Carolina imeanzia North Carolina kwa beach then merge onto I40 West hii kitu nayo kuongea imetoka imeanzia 40 40 East hiyo highway umeona hapo inaanzia kwa beach North Carolina inaitwa Wilmington Beach yinje inaenda 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 mpaka inafika hii 40 East hey, inaenda mpaka mwisho wa dunia mpaka mahali tena ni coast to coast India in a end of Wenda. Eh, what are you saying? By the way, Kuna Kunam to a menu Lisa Maliko comments. Bona Gariangu in a Kai Mechapa, Kuliko is a Garizote, Mnona is a Garizote, Ningi. Is a Garizote, Mnona Ningi. Manze Nimpia Mpia Nimajip. Kama ile jeep pale mbele yangu uko na hii iko hapa right before me ni Tundra ni Toyota ni kama zile ma Toyota Hilux nzito lakini kubwa zaidi ya hiyo na hizi kai gari nanipita ni Chevy na ni nguvu sana e, kuna mtu ameniuliza mbona mimi endesha gari mzee e, nikaa ninachoma picha hapana sichomi picha actually wasika mi wengi wenye utaona wakiendesha gari mzee wako na mabiashara ndogo ndogo tutakagi maloons kitu ya pili e, na biashara zetu ni ndogo zinalete do poa lakini si tena do nyingi tuweze kulipia gari expensive na sababu ya lifestyle yetu kama hii lifestyle yangu si wasi wengi wako nayo hati ninamka asubuhi ninaanza kuedit ma video ninapata ma down payment za majobu kasa hii ni majob tu ninatafuta za next summer na vitu kaa hizo ndio tunalipa bills tunajijenga ndio tuna tuna nini ninaishi poa but the moment utaanza kuendesha gari kaa hii imenipita tu saa hizi umejiongelezea bill ingine ya payment karibu ya 450 to 500 dollars alafu insurance ingine tena juu by the time umelipia gari kama hii kwa nyuma yangu ama hizi zote ziko mbele yangu unless uko na job ama busy yako ni ya nguvu yani hata kulipia gari si shida vile na hapo bado sijafika but kwenye niko nina Ford van kama hii ni van poa ni ya 2006 inaendesha poa kitu tu imetokana ni kitamba hapa juu imetokana but hii gari iko proper Nina afford kuifix ikiaribika kajuzi nime spend 500 dollars on it kuifix but sasa fadhali ni spend yo 500 dollars kuifix inipeleke one year after one year ni spend another 600 
inipeleke another year badala ya ku spend 600 every month ya loan ninaipatia mtu bank na hiyo pesa ninaitumia ku travel natumia ku buy equipment kama iko hapa nyuma natumia kulipa rent kwa yenye ni studio yangu niko na lifestyle poa sina supervisor mimi ndio nachagua job zangu and all that so it comes with some sacrifice unaweza hata hizi magari for a while but watu wangu eh kama uko America download tap tap na utume bob moja 1 dola na kodi yangu 254 sam 254 maybe mki download enough nipewe do nyingi zaidi na tap tap ni next time utanipata na van kama hii lazima mtu anyenyeke hii America haina mama ya mtu ukikosa customer pesa ipotee utalala nje so hii America ni ngumu hatuna ocha tutakimbia kwenda kula mandizi ama kwa anko yangu ama kwa nani ni mimi mimi and me alone hapa America nina friends but they can only help you so much jua hata wako na shida zao na hata friends wangu wengi wanaendesha magari poa poa but wako na majob na wenye wana biashara wengine zime grow zime machua hapo for years so hata wame buy magari zao with the business itself so wana zi write off kwa taxes vitu kama hizo so basically yeah ndio hiyo jibu umepata e, mwenye aliuliza mbona ninaendesha gari imechapa ya yeah, mimi loni yenye najua naweza support America ni ya nyumba na hata siku hizi nyumba kaa unaweza cooperate na wife msinunue nyumba yenu ya kwanza ka dream house nunueni duplex ama fourplex yenye inaweza lete mnaweza weka tenants na mtainunua as first time home buyer na very little down payment after hiyo mnunue duplex ingine na ingine juu lazima muishi wani ya kwa hizo duplex mkinunua duplex moja this year lazima muishi kwa one year by the law kama inunua na loan ya kawaida hii ya first time home owners e, mkinunua hivyo lazima muishi one year then mtoke mnunue ingine muishi one year mtoke hizi zote mnatoka mmerentisha inakuwa poa lakini saa zingine bwana ako na hiyo idea bibi hana inabidi tu mnunue dream house yenye inamkula forever bana inamkula forever but siezi sema kitu jua hata mimi maybe ju nitaoa maybe bibi yangu atataka tununue duplex for our first house atataka maybe ni tununue dream house na ita itatuzindua miaka nyingi haitatusaidia sana ndio hizo grow but my friend kama wewe mko karibu kuana na wife hata kabla muoane na mnajua mnaoana wacha wife inunue duplex peke yake as a single lady na wewe ununue duplex peke yako mteka advantage ya first time home owner buyers 3% down payment yeye aishi hapo one year wewe uishi hapo one year after one year mshaoana mkampa moja mkikampa moja gava inakubali mubaye duplex ingine as married couples na hiyo hiyo privilege ya 3%. Mnaona? Mnaona Kenya nasema mkinunua hiyo ya 3% mko na duplex ya tatu So duplex basically hizo huwa na two doors, two doors, two doors. Hizo ni six doors mko nazo by the time mmeoana. Six doors. Of course lazima mkuwe na credit poa na tupesa kwa account to hizo deposit. Na mmeka hizo huku nyumba US aziko sagi watu. Watu watakuwa So mmeka watu mko na watu wana rent by the time mnanunua dream house yenu inalipiwa na hizi ma duplex tatu ama nne zenye mmenunua pamoja juu watu wa rent kama landlord wangu kwenye na rent yeye ulipa less than a thousand mortgage yake but mi umlipa more than 1500 dollars close to 2000 dollars mortgage unaona analipa mortgage yake na bado anajilipa mia ingine ka nane on top. Unani get? So bibi na bwana Africans mkiwa hapa wa Afrika wachaneni kukimbiza nyumba za dream house kabla mu invest. Muki mkikimbiza nyumba kimbizeni as investors not as dream house. Hii mambo ya dream house wachaneni nayo kwanza. 
but siwezi sema kitu jo hata mimi naweza pata wife aniambie hey, babe lazima dream house lazima dream house saa zingine wanaume boy child atunaga choice na pia saa zingine madem mnataka hivyo na maboys wenyu pia wanasema ah mimi nataka dream house juu maboys wengine wanataka ku show off venye wako na nyumba kubwa na ya maana hiyo imsaidi anza ni anzeni mu approach buying house as an investment approach it like a realtor who is investing then in the next 10 years come back and thank me eh lakini saa saa ingine you don't have control over that <laughs> Kuoa ni ngumu saa zingine. What the heck man? But tuendelee na safari ya Tennessee bado tunasonga giza imeanza kuingia polepole. Pole. Nataka kumuonyesha venye mimi upika kachai kwa barabara. Kachai tu katamu, karibu kachai kana test kale Kanyeri kale. Yeah. Kale Kanyeri pale asubuhi mapema. Eh, wanatengeneza chai kwa ile gas station pale inaitwa Loves. Naona wako nayo huku Vagina, I mean Virginia, guy. Eh, sema kuita kuita state ya wenyewe jina vibaya. Eh, kwa ile Loves, so acha tuende muone venye mimi upika kachai kazuri sana. Ah, uh, sijisiki na chai so but na ndapika for the sake of it. kaka kamnyweso ndio yako lakini si supportiki kukunywa kamnyweso kameharibia watu wengi maisha huko US by the history ya mnyweso America afadhali tu mtu wa quit aileta gibidi unaweza gonga chupa mbili tu saa hizi alafu kigonga chupa mbili saa hizi usimamishwe na karao uingie kwa ngori sawa cheni tupike kachai tupike kachai venye mimi udu tachukua hii small cup stacky chai sana size so alafu pia nime nimelenga sukari sikunywi sukari mob sana kaka sukari kiasi tu kiasi kama krima zimearibika kuna kama shinika kutuwekea maziwa hapa lakini kameharibika so tuta tatumia tu maziwa ya hizi packet hizi. Unatumia maziwa inaitwa half and half. Mwanzo hii utest ka UHT ya kitambo. Watu wa old school si kama najua UHT. Eh maziwa ingine creamy. Unaweka tu maziwa ka kumi ka utu. Ama tutano hivi. Ukiweka tutano hivi, chai kameshika. Natafuta tu majani. tafuta tu majani kwa ndio utu hapa. Mimi nakuja hapa. Usichague tu majani pingine ni toa lemon. Nachukua utu unaona. Majani inaitwa chai. Chai spice. Ndio chai imefika America na ubaya sana. Watu wanaikunywa. Miweka tea bags mbili. Ndio kashike. Tiga tea bag moja uaishiki. Naweka mbili. chao heka hivyo natingiza kidogo ndio ichanganye sukari na hiyo maziwa hiyo maziwa ni strong then unakuja hapa na sema naeka ma, maji moto hot water moto kaa chonjo zitameke ndio hiyo chai na hivyo pole pole then unakuja kwa microwave ekelea kitu naeka dakika tatu tatu ni mzuri
ikamwagika karibu yote so itabidi niongezee kamaji na kamaziwa na tumajani alafu ndio isikue madharau ni wapanguzie kidogo isikue madharau ni wapanguzie kidogo ya yeah. hapa ataka sifai kupanguza sasa zingine tu ni poa kuonyesha ni uzuri kichafu wa mahali panguza jua tu wanadu job hapa wako kwa shift wamechoka wamechoka sana ukianza kuwa mesmesi hivi si poa ukianza kuwa mesi hivi sio poa so we make sure to what clean uta clean to venye utaweza then uko kwingine watajipa watajipanga eh, lakini bado lazima ni clean a little more ni lazima pepa hapa nitatumia hivi safisha fiche ile ya wa manzi nimefanya hizi job za jareja hizi za kufanya kwa gas station hiyo zinalipa na zinalipa bills but wa watu fanyishwa job mob so kimesi kidogo saa nyingine kama unaweza clean up alafu sasa hii unaona nimepacha hapa kiwa safi siwezi toka nikiwa guilty mm. Eh hey, hivyo ndio watu do usifanye watu madharau atijua naweza clean anyway Hiyo chai haijaleta bibi bado So acha niongezee kama ziwa juu chai imemwagika au sio Imemwagika Sasa irudisha kwa microwave na stongeza majani hiyo majani na kai kwa strong enough sai ah hizo tatu zitarudisha chai kwe sawa alafu kikijiko hapa koroga mzuri ah chai imeiva chai imeiva hii chai ni tamu kaa ya nyeri hmm? na ni moto unaona mpaka nimemwaga huko kwa nini ni halfu clean up ah kuna kifuniko yake kifuniko yake unichukua kifuniko ya chini kidogo usikue chukue kifuniko ya juu ukiona hii ndio iko juu chukue yenye iko next juu watu wamezishika shika na mikono chafu saa zingine ah by the way wazungu saa zingine wengine ni wachafu Oh, gangi mikono. Oh, I hope it's not as as uh, as cold as I think. Yeah, it's gloomy over here. Today. <laughs> I know. Where am I? Am I in North Carolina still? You are in North Carolina. Yes. Oh, okay. Sir. Okay. From the Tennessee border. Oh, really? Yes, sir. Okay. Thank you. Mmesikia huyo mlami venye amenisho? Niko 81 miles away kabla niingie Tennessee. Sasa noma nikuwa nimesahau kwenye nilikuwa nimepark. Nilikuwa nimepark wapi? Oh, pale juu. Nimeona gari. Um, e, chai ndio hiyo. Na mlami hapo ameniongelesha poa, nikamshow naenda kushoot video mahali. E, nikamshow mimi ni YouTuber. E, so nile Ah uh, nina uh, uh, wako sawa ameniuliza niaje nina record nikawashu ah ni mimi ni youtuber hakuwa na noma so big ups to love love ndio gas station ya kusimama kwa highway hawa nilipagi <laughs> kufanya hii kazi yote ni venye tu nawapenda wao ni treat poor na kachai kameiva so 
si tuendelee na safari au si watu wangu hey wase check in the real adventure the real adventure hapa ni makona na milima ni teremko ingine noma noma wow hasta shikilia camera for long hii ni ngori hii ni gwani Nimepata the worst experience ever ya ku set up kwa event. Manzi nimekuja hapa Gaylord Nashville ku set up manzi. Wa imeni take karibu 2 hours kupata hata hall na parking na nini na ikaniuma do. Manzi ni noma. Hi place inaitwa Gaylord Gaylord Nashville. Sijua najiita aje kuna Gaylord ya Maryland ya wapi? Eh but here Nashville haiwezi haiwezi usifanye wedding hapa ini place ya ujinga sana lakini anyways ni place ya nguvu at the end of the day si mbaya ni ile experience ya kusaidia customer hawana wanasaidia ma big time tu mashow zile kubwa kubwa lakini wakaniona na kavan kangu hapo wanaona ah huyu ni mtu amekuja kungangana na ku DJ DJ but anyway eh tuendelee na kazi Nisha drop my equipment sani kwenda kufanya fanya job kufanya job like i said sita share hii wedding sana juu ni private wedding so ah uh, tu tu share experience ya huku Nashville ndio hiyo hapo